It's not an issue. What's I your just, name and badge number real quick? My name is Brian Torres, badge 10159. Right. I'm just a little concerned because as policemen, you should know that we have very important things to include weapons. What do you got? What do you got in this vehicle? Like and anything suspicious you're not supposed to have? There is not anything suspicious. So in then, what's there. the issue? I'm just letting you know that we do have things in our vehicles, and I'm just wondering why you're recording it. Welcome to Frauditor Schmauditor, where I bring you tales of the stupid. A big thanks to all my subscribers for their support and comments. To be notified of new videos, consider subscribing to the Frauditor Schmauditor family and clicking the bell icon. And please like, share, and comment. Watch through to the end and count the number of times Mr. Frauditor throws a hissy fit. This video features Joey the Frauditor up to his tricks again. Enjoy and bring out the popcorn. And here is the star of this video. What is it with frauditors wanting to film the insides of police vehicles? Are they really hoping to see some contraband, or is it to see whether they have information on that laptop screen? What do you people think? Does this action in any way enforce the First Amendment right? Let me know in the comments. This guy's a joke. Whatever you want, dude, but is there a problem? Why are you recording the cop car, the inside of the vehicle? You know we have very important things in those vehicles, right? Is that an issue? Is that an issue? Yes, obviously. And that is how frauditors always annoy others, because that is an issue. People don't want their personal information to be recorded anywhere, because they have no idea how frauditors are going to use it. It's not an issue. What's your name and badge number real quick? My name is Brian Torres, badge 10159. I'm just a little concerned because as policemen, you should know that we have very important things to include weapons. What do you got, what do you got in this vehicle? Like anything suspicious you're not supposed to have? There is not anything suspicious so in then what's there. The issue? I'm just letting you know that we do have things in our vehicles, and I'm just wondering why you're recording it. The windows of the police car are tinted, so people from the outside cannot easily look inside. Yes, the police car is funded by taxpayers, but does that give frauditors the right to find sneaky ways to look inside, much less record the insides? Just because, I mean, if just you because. Can record it all you want, I'm just kind of curious, my man. Oh, I don't you know. know. I'm, I'm just, as, I just like officer, to record everything. Officer, my job and responsibility is to direct my attention to something that may be suspicious, and this, that what you're doing is a little suspicious to be yeah, recording my office. Suspicious? Are, is it suspicious a crime? No. I am curious about one thing: what part of a taxpayer-funded building can be used to maintain privacy? According to frauditors, they, as taxpayers, should have access to every part of the building. Well, suspicion is not a crime. So then what's it up? It is not, but that's why I'm addressing it. All right. That's well, why you're not in handcuffs, because if it was a crime, you'd be in handcuffs. You understand? And then, and then the lawsuit will be on, in progress. Listen, we don't have a problem with no lawsuit. I'm just telling oh, you. Oh, you don't? I'm just telling you. You don't care if you I get a lawsuit? I don't have a problem with a lawsuit because I'm not doing anything wrong. It's just your vehicle? That is not my vehicle. So then what's the issue? What's yours? My issue is because now I don't I know what my room. officer has in the car. I don't know. That's I'm why I'm looking in here. I represent Miami-Dade County right now, and therefore you're looking at Miami-Dade County police vehicles. Check so it I'm out. Check wondering. it out. Check it out. Do, do, do you know what, what, is, the, what, what is the issue, my man? I'm just, I'm just checking for? if it's clean. If you guys have any bazookas in there, bazookas. Yeah, like grenades, maybe kilos. I don't know. Kilos. You guys, you guys. I don't know. You guys are imperfect. Listen, my man. Nobody, you guys are imperfect. You're, you're right. Nobody is perfect. So but what's I'm, the issue? But there's not gonna be a bazooka. Like how do you know that? Perfect. It's not your vehicle, you said. No, this is not my vehicle. And I can so tell how you do you know that? That I will stand by any officer that belongs to this vehicle, and I can tell you, there's nothing, that, nothing like that. Back now, to there is something suspicious by me. Addressing an individual. How would you like it if I recorded your car? Why not? You know, you know it's my rights, the First Amendment. You know the free press that you sworn off to? Mr. Frauditor, how can anyone take you seriously when you go on this endless rant about police keeping various things in their cars? A rant that has no basis. If you are so distrustful of police, then shouldn't you be talking to the people who fund the police? Oh, yeah. That would be you, since you claim you are a taxpayer. Hmm. Talk about a fly in the ointment. I mean, I'm in public. I'm dude. just asking you a simple question. Do you know you what the Clearview Doctrine is? Yep, the mention of Clearview Doctrine had to come up sometime. Problem is, none of the frauditors know what the doctrine is. And by the way, it is called the Plain View Doctrine, not the Clearview Doctrine. It is a rule of criminal procedure which allows an officer to seize evidence of a crime without a warrant when the evidence is clearly visible. An officer, 
someone who is authorized. It does not apply to everyone. You know what that is? You know how you look Listen, in people's vehicles? I'm asking when you, you a simple question. All right, what's the question? It depends what question. I don't really answer questions, but it okay. depends. All right. Listen, you want to ask me all the questions. I'm going to ask you one. I can't. You're a servant. And it's very simple. No, no, it's very simple. My man. No, this, this is not the way it works. The inside I, of the just, I just told you because I want to. Okay. That is not a legit reason. There has no. to be something that you'll be looking for. I, I just told you. Bazookas. Now, the rate of burglaries in this area is very high. So, yes. That, that, that has, not, that has nothing to do with me. We're in downtown. You think I'm going to burglarize the vehicle? Yes, Mr. Frauditor, your actions show that you could be up to no good and maybe are recording to see which cop cars may have the keys in the ignition. Who knows? Are you saying that no one should consider your actions suspicious? I don't know what you're going to do. That's why I'm addressing the situation. Well, I'm addressing you. I'm, I'm addressing you. What, what, what I'm doing. No, you're not. You're just no. giving me a simple answer. Nobody says, hey, listen, I'm just looking at the cop car because I feel like But why don't you just keep, keep, why don't you just get back to work then? Why don't you go do something else? No, this is, this is, my, my top car's it's coat? not your car. It's not. You pay, you pay monthly bills for this car? We all do. It's called taxes. Yeah. Who pays the taxes? The people. The people. And you're, I do you're too. a welfare recipient. You are a welfare recipient. It comes no, from I'm, us. I'm not a welfare recipient. No. Yep. Sure, frauditor boy. Someone who works is a welfare recipient. That makes a lot of sense. Oh, okay. So you're private? You're, no, you're, I pay taxes. Yeah. I where does taxes. your taxes come from? It comes, it comes from my paycheck. Yeah. Where does your paycheck come from? Who pays your paycheck? I, in essence, we all pay my paycheck. Who's we yes. all? Who, who is I it? pay taxes, dude. Dude, listen to me, Everybody bro. Everybody here pays taxes. You're, you're, you're letting her looking good right now for your department. Listen, it's not about looking good or not. I'm just letting you know. No, you don't want to look professional and, know, and, and, and look like you have some knowledge on the First Amendment? Listen, it's not about the First Amendment. It's not the Bro, I'm looking in the vehicle right now. Do you look? No, not to look in the cop car. That's it. What do you mean not? What are you gonna do if I keep on doing it? There's nothing. I'm just, I'm just wondering. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna keep doing, doing it. it. I'm gonna do it to that one and that one and that one. Just because you came out and just feel uncomfortable on figuring, on, on wanting to know. And I am not bro, uncomfortable you, you, by any means. I'm just wondering you, you why. You're Does that sound like a whiny crybaby? If I look inside, what are you going to do? I am going to do it. Just cause you told me not to. Sounds like a two-year-old. Triggered to me, bro. I'm not. I'm not. You can record whatever you want to record. I, exactly. That's what I'm, I just told you why. No, you didn't. You I want to check for illegal like substances in illegal here. Illegal substances. Yeah, I've caught them before in here. What have you caught them? I don't have to answer questions. that question, but I have. You don't have to answer any questions. Not, not, not that one. It depends. That's it. All right, go ahead and check the car. Go ahead. I already did. I go already ahead. did. This guy. This guy's the biggest. More. I don't. I don't Who is this you. guy? Who is this guy? I don't need your ID. I didn't ask for it. Bro, he wants to know. He says it's suspicious. But I told him there might be Kilos in there, bazookas, you know. Anything, anything illegal. You guys are not perfect. You know the corruption that's going on here in, the, in America with you guys? With the government? Not, tell me, bro. Because you, so uh, you guys are the genius. No, you guys so you got... Tell me. No, I don't have to you tell, tell you. You corruption. should know about it. You work for it. No, I don't know anything about any corruption. Just listen, bro. About anything. I'm just Why don't you officer. just get back to work? You're dismissed. I'm just an officer who was actually making an important You're phone dismissed, call. bro. I, had to, I no, didn't go no, up to you. You don't have to dismiss me. No, but I am. No, you don't I bet you you'll leave that. before me. How much you want to make a bet? Oh, I'm going to walk away now. All right, then. Peace. I have, nothing, I have nothing else to say to you, but All I'm peace. just letting you know that what you're doing I is I didn't even interrupt. Right. So, and? What is go suspicious ahead, about that? You want. Bro, this guy's though. I, I have three questions. That's okay. <laughs> right, no, yeah, I'm only gonna answer one, and then I'm gonna oh, walk away. Right, so I'm gonna pick my question very carefully. Uh -huh. <laughs> How much money do you earn? Frauditor boy is recruiting young minds now. That is a shame. A real shame. That I'm not gonna address. You can go ahead and find it. Now online. I'm gonna put it online. I, I already your, told him. Torres one zero one five nine. Thank you, sir. Here you go, my man. Which you want to see it? Where's your bulletproof rest? I'm not gonna lie to you. Showing you my ID because I'm on probation. Okay. Where's your bulletproof rest? I'm not Where's your bulletproof you rest? Not no, I already got it, yeah. You sure. got it? Your, your finger's blocking it. No, the other one. The index finger. There it is. Brian Torres. Have a good day. Thank you, sir. I'm going to get your paycheck. Thank you. Dismissed. Hey, you're more than welcome. Bye-bye. 10159. Thank you. Kick some rocks while you're at it. If Thank you can you. find some right there. Are you, sir, do you consider yourself overpaid? Bro, this guy's a joke, bro. I consider myself well-paid. You consider, Thank I, you. I consider you as a, as, a, as a clown costume cop. Wasn't this an entertaining video? Watching Mr. Frauditor acting like a child. I guess the other Frauditor wannabe is going to have another channel soon. Non-stop entertainment. Well, that's it, folks. If you liked this video and got some entertainment value, please like, share, subscribe, hit the bell icon to get notifications of new videos. And of course, feel free to comment your thoughts. See you on the next one.